Hey, what is up guys? My name's Rectified and in today's episode we'll be playing some more Fallout 3 campaign and we are starting from where we left off which is we got the Gek and um, we ended up finding a super mutant, a friendly one and his name was Fox and what happened was I followed Fox and he showed me where to find the Gek and um, yeah so I've got the Gek now and my new objective is to take it back to Vault 8 Actually, my objective is to, to escape from Vault 87. Sorry, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, like, go to Vault 87. I'm already in Vault 87. Yeah, but anyways, guys, um, sorry for the upload schedule being all over the place. Here's Fox. So, um, yeah, now I'm just gonna leave Vault 87. Go leave it. Yeah, we had to go through a lot of super mutants to get here, which was kind of annoying, but hey. This is Fallout, and there are, there are a lot of enemies in interiors, I will say that. So yeah, I went in this room and I found quite a lot of stuff. Yeah. Why did I forget to pick up the stim packs? I always forget to pick up stuff like stim packs, guys. It's just so annoying. Alright, so we're gonna come down here and we're gonna open this door to get out. Whoa. Whoa. Yo, we just got flashbangs, man. We have some enclave soldiers. And Objective is secured, sir. Good work, soldier. Make sure the Gek is secured aboard my Vertibird. Yes, sir. I'll have the text come down and remove it immediately, sir. You're certain he's unharmed? Yes, sir. He'll pass out shortly, but we can revive him. Excellent. Prepare him for transport immediately. Right away, sir. Wow, so, um, the Enclave have just kidnapped us, and... So, you're awake. Let's keep this nice and simple. You're going to tell me the code for that purifier, and you're going to tell me now. Now... Now, we're just in the Enclave place right now, and they've just kidnapped us. So, um, what the hell is going on here? I'll tell you what's going on here. You lost. The good guys won this one, and now we're just wrapping up loose ends. We've got the purifier, now we just need the code to start it. You're going to give me that code now, and save us all a lot of trouble. Maybe I'll even let you go. So how about it? Um, fuck you, I'm not telling you anything. I'll be honest. I'm running out of patience here, and I'm not looking to play games with you. You tell me that code, or it's going to cost you. Well, I don't know what the code is. You lie. Colonel, I have need of you. Mr. President, I have no time for other matters. I'll be with you shortly. Now, Colonel. Yes, sir. Ah, alone at last. I do apologize for Colonel Autumn's attitude. He's been under a great deal of stress lately. I've no doubt that you know who I am. I'm sure you've heard my radio broadcasts. I'd like to have a word with you face to face. I think there are a few things that you and I should discuss. You'll find your possessions in the locker near the door. I'll unlock the way for you. And I'll unlock your restraints as well. I'll be waiting for you in my office. Please don't carry. Wow, so, um... 
We've just been kidnapped by the Enclave and our guy is naked. So yeah, he said our stuff was... Okay, so he said our stuff was in like a locker. Alright, so what perk should I choose? I'll go with um, Bloody Mess, why not? Alright, so we just started the quest American Dream. And yeah, so we've just been kidnapped by the Enclave, and he said our stuff was in this locker. And that guy we're talking to was Colonel Autumn, the one in the purifier. So, just in case you're a bit lost on the story. Yeah, my power helmet's broken. How about that for a start? Hold it right there. You're supposed to be in that holding cell. You're not going anywhere. There's a full complement of guards in the next room. As soon as I get them, you're going back to your cell. In a body bag, if necessary. Take a hike before you get squashed. I, uh, I, I have somewhere else to be. Right, so I just used my strength on him, so... They're not who they say they are. Get out while you can, before they get you too. Wow, um, that's Nathan from Megaton. Uh, yeah, I think he got kidnapped as well. Hello. You're supposed to be the president, then go do it. Yeah, there's not much in here actually. Like, we'll find a lot of like microfusion cells in this area. Because we're in the Enclave base right now. So, I'm going to make my way upstairs and see what I can find. Attention. Well, um, I better start killing him now if he wants me to be killed. shot that's nice that and we'll take some uh, microfusion cells yeah some microfusion cells I don't really take plasma mines that much but yeah because I don't really need them Alright, some recon armor in here. Missiles. Um, nothing in here. I can hear some Enclave soldiers, so yeah. I don't get why there's so much random ammo in the Enclave base. Shouldn't there be microfusion cells like 
just microfusion cells. Unless they collect stuff from the wasteland. I mean, you've got plenty of plasma rifles. I don't see why you should be using shotguns. Alright, so where is... Now I'll just keep this laser rifle. I don't really care. It's not letting me kill. It's not letting me kill her. Whoa, I just blew her into pieces. <laughs> that was insane. I'm run out of ammo, so I'll just use this. Fall back. All right, so I think you can find like loads of stim packs in this room, if I can remember correctly. They're on here. Alright, let's go downstairs. Go under here. Yeah. You know, the one thing I like about this is that because the floor is like graded, they dropped all their knives and forks underneath this floor by accident when they were eating, so <laughs> there's that many under here. Then they just didn't bother to clean this up. Like, I think everybody's at least noticed that. That was easy. That was easy. So. There we are. Fully. Well. Fully conditioned laser pistols. And now I can just go get my energy cells from here. No. When will they start carrying microfusion cells? Because I need some. I'm just going to get rid of some food. There we are. And now, I'm just going to loot him. 
yeah, what's in this foot locker? Absolutely nothing. I'm just gonna use my um as a rifle. Oh yeah. Yeah, this this'll kill him good. So I'm just gonna go and see if we're um, I don't think anyone's in here. Alright, here we are. I'm just, I might actually... I'll check over here, see if there's anything I can get. Wow, there's nothing over there then. And some more microfusion cells. You? You're not supposed to be in here. What are you doing here? Wait a minute, what are you doing here? They... they captured me. Brought me here from Project Purity. I didn't want to help them at first, but the technology they have here, it's so far advanced from anything I've worked with. You've been helping them? Of course. You've seen the kind of technology these people have. They want to help people. They want to change the wasteland. I couldn't pass up an opportunity to work in an environment like this. Why would you abandon everything you worked for with Dr. Lee? Look, it's not personal. Really, it's not. But Dr. Lee, she's scraping by. She's scavenging for parts in the wastes. The Enclave has everything it needs. They're light years ahead of anything Dr. Lee could accomplish. Working here is my best chance to help make the world a better place. You betrayed Dr. Lee and my father. I'm sorry you see it that way. What are you going to do? Kill me over it? You should go. It sounds like you're in enough trouble as it is. And honestly, I don't want anyone to see me talking to you. Alright, so I'm just going to kill her for working with the Enclave, because that just sucks. I don't see why Enclave soldiers wear recon armor. It just makes no sense. I think only Brotherhood wear that sort of stuff, don't they? Oh, last attempt. That was good. Now, disable barrier. Alright, so I'm going to keep going down here, see what I can find.
There we go. So I'm going to go upstairs and I'm going to check some lockers. Okay, so it seems like they carry a lot of cigarettes here on Cliff. I think they just like cigarettes in this place. Alright, I'm gonna go downstairs. Yeah, I think I'm lost. I'll just go straight forward, really. And into this room. Or maybe not. Yeah, no one gets away from me. Right, I'm going in this room. Now, what is the... Oh, I think there's... Yeah, the energy weapons bobblehead. But I don't need it because I already have 100 we energy weapon skill. Alright, so I don't need to um, repair my laser rifles. No. I don't need to repair them. But, yeah, there's a terminal right here. Oh, second attempt. That's good. Disable barrier. And now we can steal some ammo. And meds. God. They carry too much non-energy weapon ammo. I mean, you don't need to use non-energy weapons when you've already got powerful enough weapons to kill people. Alright, so the president wants to see me, so I'll go upstairs. Just um, quick save. Yeah, see what he has to say to me. Go through here, go upstairs. And. Ah, face to face at last. It's high time. I'm quite pleased you were able to make it. The trip was not what I had intended, but serves as an adequate test of your abilities. It's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. President. You're too kind. The pleasure is mine, I assure you. I've been anxious to make your acquaintance for some time. You and I have much to discuss, my young friend. I like how all this time President Eden is just like some robot in a monitor. Because, well, people think that there has been an actual elected president in the wasteland. And people believe this guy's rule, but he's just like a brain inside a computer. I'm listening. Our nation's capital is at a crossroads. The 
path that you and I choose here today will affect us all. I need you to act on my behalf to ensure that our country's future is secured. What country? Look around. Everything's destroyed. That's a bit of a bleak outlook, don't you think? The United States has fallen on hard times, yes, but it can be healed. You have that power to heal within you, if you allow yourself to act. What I ask of you needs explanation, so you understand why it must be done. Perhaps that will stir you to act. Please go on, I'm intrigued. The good people of this country cannot regain control while mutation runs rampant through our land. My soldiers cannot stem the tide, nor can the cult you've come into contact with, this brotherhood of steel. Mutations like the super mutants and ghouls must be purged from our society, our world, before we can proceed anew. Where others have failed, I believe, your father's work can succeed. My father's work? How is that relevant? The purifier your father helped create has the ability to provide clean water to the whole of this capital wasteland. With a simple modification, it can be used to distribute agents that destroy mutated creatures upon ingestion. In time, we could eliminate all mutations in the wasteland. At the same time, the good people of the world regain their health. I need you to make the modification necessary for this to succeed. That doesn't like some doesn't sound like something I'd like to know how to do. What I require of you is really very simple. There is a vial in front of you filled with a modified FEV virus. It needs to be inserted into the control console for the purifier. Once that is done and the activation code is entered, the purifier will be activated and the process will be automated. It's not too much to ask of you, is it? No way. I'm not doing that. I find that unfortunate and most disappointing. I must impress upon you the severity of the situation. I cannot allow you to leave unless the vial is in your possession. You can't be president. You're an abortion of science. You need to die. Really? Do go on. You aren't programmed for self-awareness. You said so yourself. This is quite true. The process was certainly unintended, but shouldn't we all be thankful that I'm here now? But how do you know what you're doing is right? Because unlike humans, I am infallible. And how do you know you're infallible? Because I've been programmed to be, of course. That's circular logic. You know because you're... You know it makes no sense. Processing. Internal logic error detected. I think you're delusional. I think the world would be better off without you. Resetting primary memory circuits. Please stand by. Perhaps, well, perhaps there is a problem. I, I am unsure how to proceed. Shut yourself down. Shut down this whole place. Processing directive. New directive accepted. Self-destruct sequence initialized. Civilian is advised to remove hazardous FEV material and exit at once. Alright, so he wants us to take this, but we can't leave without taking it. Must be secured before door locks are released. Security protocol Gamma 3. Yes, yeah, so we'll just take it.
Whoa, this very bad. Alright, I'm gonna kill it. Alright, I almost died there. So I'm just gonna quick save. Now, what's in here? Damn, that... that sucks. Alright, so... What's in here? Yeah, nothing. Still need to repair my helmet. Right, so there's like a massive ammo stash down here. Right, I'm looking for a plasma rifle. Because I really do want one so I can upgrade my stuff. Or at least just give me loads of plasma rifles so I can upgrade everything. Ah, uh, doesn't work. Yes. Second attempt. No, third attempt. That was the third. Alright, disable barrier. Was Gatlin Lizard here? Repair my vengeance. There we are. Plasma rifle. I use that to repair my stuff. Alright, A321's plasma rifle. Repair that. Uh, why not take plasma pistol? We've got some Tesla armor here, which is good. Um, I really want to take it, but I just know I can't. Alright, DR. DR5. Right, you know what, I'm going to have to leave it because I know I can find some later on in the game anyways, so it's not like a rare thing. Whoa. Ah, it just blew up.
Yeah, I think we just blew up Raven Rock. And it's not even finished blowing up. Well, that was... that was something. Well, there goes that. <laughs> and I think I saw a fox. Yeah, he had a Gatling laser. Oh, he said he didn't want to follow me, though. survived and I had hoped to assist in your rescue to repay my debt to you looks like you've got a new toy huh yes and the most fascinating one at that Whoa, this technology is amazing imagine the evil that can be eliminated with such tools Fox, what the hell are you doing here? I saw your capture, and a little cleverness allowed me to follow your captors. Uh, I only wish I could have arrived sooner to aid your escape. As I owe you my freedom, I felt it was only fair that I return the favor. After all, I know no one else in this world. I could always use a hand. Would you like to follow me? My friend, I would be honored to follow a hero such as yourself. Shall we go? Wow, so we just got Fox as a companion, which is great. Okay, so I'm afraid I have to end this video now. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Make sure to follow me on Twitter too, and I'll see you all later. Bye.